हेलो एंड वेलकम टू आर नेक्स्ट लेक्चर ऑन ऑर्डनरी फर्स्ट ऑर्डर ऑर्डनरी डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन प्रीवियसली वी लर्न हाउ टू सॉल्व फर्स्ट ऑर्डर लीनियर डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन एंड वी सॉल्व द बर्नोली इक्वेशन टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस रिकेटी इक्वेशन सो इन रिकेटी इक्वेशन द सब्सटीट्यूशन वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग the substitution which work is y equal to y1 plus 1 over v and i'm going to explain about this substitution and about the riccati equation now and this substitution will convert our riccati equation into first order linear od so let's start with riccati equations riccati equation looks like dy over dx plus pxy equal to qx plus rx times y square here if you observe if qx is equal to 0 then this equation this riccati equation is nothing but it will reduce to bernoulli equation and how we solve bernoulli equation we already discussed in our previous lecture also if rx equal to 0 then we have a derivative term we have a y term and function of x and in that case this is our first order linear ode in y and we know how to solve first order linear ode here we are going to consider the case if Qx is non-zero and Rx is non-zero. What we will do then? How we will solve the Riccati equation if Qx is non-zero and Rx is non-zero? We know till now we only know to solve. the riccati equation or to find a general solution of riccati equation if a particular solution is already known so we can find the general solution if a particular solution to riccati equation is already known so suppose y1x is given particular solution which we already know then to find the general solution what we are going to do is we will substitute yx equal to y1 plus 1 over v and this yx is our general solution this is the substitution and this is the only thing we need to remember that's all and this substitution when you substitute y equal to y1 plus 1 over v this substitution will change or will convert the riccati equation 
R should be capital because it's a name because uh, the substitution will change the Riccati equation to first order linear differential equation in V. differential equation in terms of V. So let's see one example and you will realize solving Riccati equation is super easy. So our example is to solve the Riccati equation dy over dx equal to e power 2x plus uh, 1 2 times e power x times y plus y square if y1 x equal to negative e power x this is a particular solution of given Riccati equation okay. let's see how we will solve this So we know that we are going to substitute y equal to y1 plus 1 over v. Our y1 is negative e power x plus 1 over v. If we are going to substitute y equal to negative e power x plus 1 over e in our Riccati equation, we need the derivative of y. which is derivative of e power x is e power x derivative of 1 over v we can calculate by power rule so basically here we are using the chain rule to find out the derivative let me write it down over here so to find out the derivative of 1 over v we are calculating the derivative with respect to v and then we are multiplying the derivative of v with respect to x this is our chain rule and the first derivative you can calculate using the power rule times dv over dx oops this is square Now we will substitute the value of y and dy over dx in equation 1. So we substitute in equation 1. And what we will get? Negative e power x minus 1 over v square dv over dx is equal to e power 2x plus 1 plus 2 times e power x times y and our y is equal to negative e power x plus 1 over v plus y square negative e power x plus 1 over v square okay so if we are doing everything correctly, this equation should reduce to first order linear ODE in terms of V. Let's see. So in the left hand side, we have negative e power x minus 1 over V square dV over dx 
equal e power 2x plus let's first distribute negative e power x so if we multiply negative e power x with 1 we will get negative e power x if we multiply negative e power x with 2 times e power x we get e power 2x now we will distribute 1 over v so if we distribute 1 over v we will get 1 over v plus 2 divided by v e power x e power x plus 1 over v square is e power 2x plus 1 over v square minus 2 times e power x divided by v let's see if we can cancel out some terms so we have negative e power x on the left hand side and on right hand side so we can cancel them out and now we have negative 1 over v square dv over dx equal to e power 2x plus e power 2x is equal to e power 2x minus e power 2 times e power 2x plus 1 over v and these two terms are also same 2 over v e power x minus 2 over e power x will cancel out plus 1 over v square these first two terms can also cancel out and the rest equation we multiply this equation by negative v square let's see what we will get so if we multiply left hand side by negative v square we will get dv by dx and that is why we were multiplying by negative v square we want the coefficient of the derivative term to be 1 equal to negative v minus 1 which is dv over dx plus v equal to negative 1 right now this is our first order first order linear equation in terms of v okay so to solve the first order linear equation we first calculate the integrating factor which is e power integration of coefficient of v which is 1 dx so our integrating factor is e power x then we multiply the equation throughout by the integrating factor we will get e power x dv over dx plus e power x v equal to negative e power x and if you have calculated your integrating factor right the left hand side will reduce to derivative of integrating factor times the dependent variable which is actually the case you can use the product tool to verify that negative e power x now we will integrate both sides with respect to the independent variable And in the left hand side, since integration and derivative are inverse of each other, we will get e power x times v. On the right hand side, 
negative integration of e power x is e power x and we never forget to add the constant of integration now if we divide by e power x we will get negative 1 plus c times e power negative x this is our v but our general solution was y equal to e power x plus 1 over v see over here this was our general solution so we will plug in our v back here e power x plus 1 over c times e power negative x minus 1 this is our solution for Riccati equation just to summarize our Riccati equation looks like dy over dx plus pxy equal to qx plus rx times y square and the only thing we need to know is we want to substitute y equal to y1 plus 1 over v where this y1 is already known particular solution and we will stop here today i'll see you in the next lecture till then take care bye bye practice some more math problems